What's up guys, my name's Ali A, this is the official Modern Warfare 3 DLC Part 1 video explaining the two maps you're going to get, Piazza and uh, Liberation, uh, within the Modern Warfare 3 DLC package, but there's loads more information I want to talk about afterwards, so listen to the trailer, watch it, enjoy it, and I'll be right back after the trailer to give you more information. We're doing an entire season of content for Modern Warfare 3. If you're an elite premium member, you get content every month for nine months. Once you've subscribed, all of the content will be made available to you directly from your console. And with this new season, it's how you'll get all that content month after month. The Modern Warfare 3 DLC season kicks off with two multiplayer maps. One is called Piazza. This takes place on the coast of Italy. The second is Liberation, and this one takes place in Manhattan. Liberation is awesome because it takes place in New York. It's one of those maps that have such iconic locations in it that you can easily call it out about the castle or fighting by the fountain. For Liberation, I think one of the big strategies that you want to try to follow is there's a lot of sniper sight lines, and you need to be cautious when you're crossing them. Don't run and gun, a little bit more methodical, and that's gonna help you survive that map. Piazza is a different type of map altogether. It's a very vertical, chaotic route map. It's primarily geared towards the guys who like the really close up run and gun. You gotta be fast. It's a challenging map, it's a technical map, but also it's important to stick with your teammates where they're covering a few cover points and you're covering a few is definitely the way you're gonna survive that map. The cool thing with Modern Warfare 3 and this entire season of content is that we have so many different opportunities with our season. Awesome multiplayer, new Spec Ops missions, extensions from the story, new game modes that we can add. We're really trying to make sure that the whole idea of the season of content is integrated not just in the maps themselves, but also within Elite. We have that entire super passionate, super vocal audience that we can pull inspiration from. We're going to start engaging the community actually in the creation of the content. It's just a much more community-friendly DLC plan than we've ever had before. I mean, with Infinity Ward, Sledgehammer, and Raven Games all contributing to the season of content, the possibilities are limitless. The season of Modern Warfare 3 content for Elite Premium members kicks off on January 24th, first on Xbox Live. Welcome back guys, my name is Ali A, so I want to explain when you guys can get this, how long it's going to last for, etc. A lot of the information I've already actually mentioned beforehand in my previous map pack videos, but I want to explain uh, something that hasn't been covered fully is when you're going to get it. So it's going to be a tier system basically, and they haven't explained it too well in this video either, because I guess it's kind of unfair to people on PC especially and PS3, but um, it works out that Xbox users with Call of Duty Elite Premium they get it first, January the 24th, and this is throughout the uh, nine month period of DLC, they're going to be getting it first. Next in line, you're going to have um, PS3 Call of Duty Elite um, Premium members joint with Xbox users, normal Xbox users. Finally, at the bottom of the tier, you're going to have normal PS3 and normal PC users, so a sort of three tier system. That's what I'm hearing, that's what I believe is correct, and that's the order it's going to be coming out in. And as I've explained in previous videos, uh, nine months of DLC, um, not just maps, you've got Piazza, which was originally thought to be uh, Italy, and um, the uh, Liberation, which we thought originally was going to be Park, because we thought when it was tweeted out, the link to the uh, picture of Park, uh, it's no longer that name, it's Liberation. They can change around for names at the last minute, to be honest, so they're just playing around with, a little bit, with us a little bit there. But uh, those are the two maps that are going to be coming first. Um, you may be wondering why there's only two maps, there's going to be around 20 pieces of DLC across the nine month period from January to September. Um, so not just maps, you know, spec op missions, uh, single player missions perhaps to extend the storyline. New guns have, as I've touched on as well, if you haven't seen that feel free to check out that video too. So that's all the information I've got for you guys here. Feel free to comment in the uh, comment box and let me know what you guys think of these two new maps. Uh, cheers for watching, got Moab videos coming soon as well, giving you guys some tips and tricks on how to get those Moabs in Modern Warfare 3. So cheers for watching and I'll catch you on my next video.